Trump may seem like a big guy, a big man, a big threat with all his racism and sexism and homophobia. When he was elected, that was the case with me, maybe for you as well. Whatever Trump calls in with his agency, whatever executive order he signs, we may not know what the next step of his master plan is. What we are doing right now is telling us we don't get to bring friends. We can't protect the innocent, peaceful people of color and Muslims being banned from the country. Whatever higher power Trump answers to, some masked man trying to keep minorities down, whether it be David Duke or Rex Tillerson, Mike Pence or Vladimir Putin, we can see he's trying to take our prize, our unity, our peace. We must light the fire and let it rise in our hearts. Trump's new world consists of him and his men, old white men. In his world, it's only one race, the white race. Trump is the bane of freedom. And if he fails, he expects to see us in the wreckage of America. Hey, what's up, bro? Oh, it's nice to meet you. Like your Ouija board, man. Thanks. Does it work? Uh, it didn't work? How you guys doing? Oh, damn, really? He was here all night? Oh, shit, I just missed him. What's up, y'all? Just stopping by on my way to work, from work. Got a hustle in this city, man. Peace. To work or one love. To work or out of work? From from one thing to another oh, thing. Ah, cool, cool. Yeah, cool. just hustling, man. Cool, man. What you, what you guys do? What are you doing out here, man? Just hanging? Just chilling.